Welcome back to the Morning Blend. If you're looking for love, then listen up. We're going to tell you about an opportunity to meet 24 of Milwaukee's most eligible bachelors and bachelorettes. In fact, they're actually going to be auctioned off live, and you could win one of them. It's mm -hmm. to help a good cause, That's too. That's right. W Girls is a volunteer organization for young professional women to set up to help underprivileged women and kids. So meet Rachel Hughes. She is the W Girls Milwaukee president. Give a little wave there. You're in a big yep. group. There, there we she go. Is. All right. We also have Jason Perry with Penn. Field Children's Center and two eligible singles who we split up on the couch. It's yeah. Mel Hendrickson <laughs> and Matt Sable Jack. Thanks for being here. Hi, guys. How are you doing? <laughs> yeah. Strike and oppose there, right? Got to work it always. Oh, exactly. <laughs> well, we'll have their numbers on the bottom of the screen yeah. later. Um, but this is really exciting. This is what your fifth annual um, auction for bachelors and bachelorettes, right? Yep, it's the fifth year. So every year we choose a different charity to um, donate the funds to. And this year we, we're super excited to be working with Penfield Children's Center. And yes, we've gathered 24 of Milwaukee's most eligible bachelors and bachelorettes. Um, and we will just be auctioning them off live in front of 500 of our closest friends tonight. <laughs> That's okay. How does it work? I mean, do they like work their stuff on the stage or? Uh, yes, some people have gotten a little crazy. <laughs> yeah, okay. I mean, whatever they want to do to sell themselves. It's basically right. up to them. How do you decide what to wear, Mel? Oh, it was really hard. I ended up actually renting a gown. So no way. I wow. couldn't find Tiffany's anything done I that to before. Buy. Yeah. Did you like rent the runway or something? I did. You did? I said rent the runway. <laughs> You're going to be glamorous, girl. <laughs> That's awesome. Glammed out. I love it. <laughs> How did you choose your bachelor and bachelorettes? These are two of the 24. How did you choose all of them? Did they say, hey, here I am, or did you go out and find them? We had a nomination period for about a month where we just opened it up to anyone who was interested in um, applying to be a bachelor or bachelorette, and then we kind of went through and did some of our own digging, and then we just basically chose different ages, professions, interests, so we, we have a pretty good mix of different uh, There men they are. are. There they are. Are they hot? I mean, do they need to be good looking? Because obviously I mean, the bachelorette and the bachelor we have here are both very good looking. Do they, is, that a, is that a requirement? <laughs> it's not a requirement, but I mean, it doesn't hurt. <laughs> <laughs> and here are our beautiful girls as well. I would think, you know, it, it's, it's very vulnerable to get up there. A, you want to raise money for a really good cause this year, Penfield. But I would think as a bachelor, bachelorette, you got to feel pretty vulnerable. You, are you bringing your friends out too? Do you really just hope other people will come out and say, hey, you know, I'm, I'm in for you? I'm I've in got for my you. mom as a safety in the <laughs> And your grandma, right? My mom and my grandma in the audience, and if I give them a thumbs up, that means keep Keep, keep bidding. Keep, keep, upping, bidding. Yeah. keep upping the number. Right. Exactly. What, I mean, what do they go for? What are some of the, 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 the biggest sellers on the runway? What, what kind of dollars can you get? Some, I think the biggest that we've had was about 1200 And then we've also had... Mel's yes. like, whoa. <laughs> do it. I'm worth it. <laughs> we've also had people say, hey, if you donate up to you know, $1,200, i will double that. So okay. really, we, bidding starts at 100 So... You'll go for at least 100. <laughs> or like Matt said, 100 a hip. It's, well, that would be 50 a hip, but I'm saying 250 a hip is my minimum. Right. Okay, gotcha. So I, I start it. at 500 is my baseline. Okay. Okay, so Matt, starting with you, and then we'll go to Mel. What, are, wh what kind of woman do you hope will bid on you? What's your ideal gal? Uh, you know, someone that may pay for the date eventually. <laughs> no, it's, it's a joke. I, Someone that's just looking to have probably, I don't know if we're going to find love here. Has anybody gotten married off of this? Uh, no marriages, but there have been some matchups that have oh, happened. Yeah. Okay. Right. You're just looking to have a fun date. And for me, it's more about the organization. I think Penfield is incredible. You know, longtime friends with Mel, and if they didn't have rules against it, she would take some of these you know, kids home and take care of them. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, you know, for me, it's uh, have a good time. It's going to be a fun <laughs> event and just, you know, looking for uh, a young lady mm -hmm. or an old lady. Or a young man or an old man. I, as I understand it, it, it doesn't anybody matter what my orientation is. Anybody could bid on you. Anybody, anybody can, can buy on you. you. Yeah. Yep. So I a mean, guy could bid on you. Yeah. Okay. And might. Which might change the date. <laughs> right. a little, might a little change bit. a little Who bit. Who designs the date once you get picked? We do. You do. We do. So do you, can you say what your date would be? Indeed. Okay. What, what is, is it? your? What, what my is date it? is I'm a big movie buff. Uh, okay. So what we did starting at Maxi Southern Comfort for dinner. Love it. And then yeah. Highway 18, there's an outdoor movie theater. Cute. So I figured if we're not getting along, that's like at least two hours of kind of not talking, right? <laughs> which is pretty good. This is strategic. Right? So how a guy is going to think right? about it. Okay. And then a Bryant's for some ice cream drinks afterwards. That if it gets kids. there. If it gets. If so it's with a woman. Of... Yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah. How about you, Mal? 
Um, the date I chose was a private VIP tour of the stadium. Oh, cute. Um, of Miller Park? Yep, of Miller Park, okay. um, which involves the press box, the locker room, um, in addition to dinner at the club, uh, the stadium club, with a game and actually batting practice on the field, which is really, Whoa. really cool. There are a lot of guys who are going to yeah. want that. <laughs> now, are you being auctioned off, Jason, too? I am not being okay, auctioned right. You know the best He's thing married. Is, is I can go oh, you're married. Set the bar. He's married. Yeah, yeah, I can set the bar nice and low, so then they have the really attractive bachelors, and it's like, it's a win-win. What do you do at Penfield? I am uh, Vice President of Development and Communications over there, and it's okay. uh, we're thrilled to be partnering with W Girls on this event. I mean, we've known about the organization for a long time, great national presence, but just the work they do in Milwaukee is, is really awesome. And what kind work do you guys do? How do you help kids? We work with uh, those real little kids, uh, birth to about age three, sometimes up to age six. Mm -hmm. Kids that are, you know, might have a developmental delay or disability. We know that if we can get to them at that early age, the progress they can make is just absolutely incredible. That's super cool. Mel, we didn't ask you um, what kind of guy would yeah. be the right date for your trip to Miller Park. Well, the reason I chose Miller Park, Park is because it's a very public place, <laughs> so I'm a little bit nervous about this. Um, but I would look for someone who is successful, um, meaning that they're motivated, not necessarily what they do, but that they're a hard worker. Um, someone who is active and loves children, because that's absolutely a necessity. That's so cool. I love what she just said. And our director in yeah. our ear goes, Does ask her she, if she likes biker guys, because he rides a Harley, right, Eric? <laughs> I yeah. do. I love bikes. <laughs> she loves bikes, Eric. <laughs> he just goes, sweet. <laughs> we'll, we'll take his Someone's bid. showing yeah. up tonight. <laughs> yeah, at least 1,200, Eric. <laughs> Um, yeah, 600 a hip. Just kidding. <laughs> um, awesome to have you guys here. Can people still be part of this event and get tickets? Yes, we have okay. tickets available online until 5 p.m. tonight, and awesome. then they're available at the door. And I should say the bachelors and bachelorettes range in age from 22 to 42, but mm -hmm. you don't have to be in that age group to make a bid, right? You have Correct. to just be 21 or over. Yep. We okay. want to go on a fun date, yeah. right? Yeah. It's so cool. I love it. Okay, so here's the information so that you can attend this fascinating event. It's Meet Your Match Bachelorette Bachelor bachelorette auction it's happening tonight from 7 until 10 p.m. at the warehouse which is on South Water Street in Milwaukee you can go to wgirls.org until 5 p.m. this evening one ticket is just 30 bucks two for 50 you can bring a date and go to meet your match um, <laughs> tickets are also available at the door for 35 bucks all guests receive two complimentary drinks with their tickets why wouldn't you want to go and support the work at Penfield Children's Center which is so cool great to have all, all of right. you here and I'll vouch for you Matt I've known you for a while you're a good guy. Thank you. There you oh, go. It's nice. Them. And I can tell already I like you. We can yeah. be BFFs. <laughs> All right. Thanks, you guys, so much. Appreciate Thank it. It was you. awesome.